stopping back by really do hope that you will enjoy this week's vlog so that you can keep coming back for more i've missed you guys so much it's been two weeks since i've been gone and that is because um i'm gonna keep it real short and real quick and that is because i had to go home because of the looting that was happening in kzn so i couldn't be at my own place alone so yeah i kind of just had to go back home and be with my family because that was the safest thing to do um since there was a lot of commotion happening on this side right so obviously i just don't get excited to make content when i'm at home so i was like you know what let me take a break and then come back bigger and stronger so now i is vic i is vivivivivic guys before we get into everything else I think it is time that I open this video the correct way, baby. Ah, uh, I am so, so happy. So I finally got my Google AdSense pen. Been waiting for this for like the longest time. Guys, I'm so, so happy that I finally got this. That means that I'm gonna start receiving my paychecks, period. And that's all, period. So as from now on, guys, please don't skip ads. Please don't Please don't skip ads. Please watch those ads. Help the girl make her coins. But yeah, that's one of the things that happened. Um, I'm having my green tea. Let me have my green tea so that I can tell you guys what's happening in this vlog. Because wow. Because wow. Okay, so basically I'm going on like a, a mini vacation. I'm going on a little everythingcation, okay? So I'm going on a friendcation. Not really contentcation because I feel like I'm not gonna have a lot of time to take pictures, but I'm going on everything cation. Period. I don't think I'm gonna be able to vlog everything simply because how do I put this in like a non offensive way? Simply because there's just some people that I can't show on the video and these are the people that I'm gonna be with like to like all the time so like so for various personal reasons i can't i can't show right so i might not be able to show you guys everything that i'm going to be doing um and i do want to be present in the occasion so i'm gonna show you guys snippets i'm gonna show you guys here and there right but i am going to be taking another vacation where it's solidly going to be for us where it's solidly i'm going to be shooting content it's going to be a content cre creation um type of thing right so i got my nails did super super happy about this red i got my my lashes did and i got ready for the vacation period so what we're gonna do now is that i'm gonna have out my tea it's still hot guys that's why i'm talking a lot i'm gonna drink up my tea then i need to pack i haven't started packing and lungi is go is coming here in about an hour's time because guys we need to we need to finalize things we need to view this other place that we want to go to in the evening um i still need to fetch my hair she still needs to do an installation we, ne we need to do our makeup we need to be at the place by six by four so it's a lot so i'm gonna take you guys through all of that today but then tomorrow going onwards i don't know we'll see I i'll do the best i can so i'm gonna have my tea then i'm gonna go shower and then I think I want to I want to mask my face and prep my face for tonight since I am going to be having like heavy makeup um, and then I'm going to pack with you guys what else did I want to tell you guys we'll see we'll catch up so you guys I wanted to tell you guys that I ordered from Sheen and Sheen Shein <laughs> long story short I don't like anything like nothing fits properly like nothing is giving me the vibes that i saw on the website nothing is fitting my body properly i've never been so upset and then um obviously the stuff that i had bought was stuff for this weekend um and then 
the stuff arrived on time not even on time the stuff arrived like four days earlier i was so happy i was so impressed and it was my first time ordering from sheen so um yeah and i used buffalo to courier my stuff but then when i fitted the stuff i was just like i played myself like i played and the funny thing is all my stuff is an extra small except for the stuff that i was intentionally um i wanted them to be baggy so that's in a medium which is like two stuff but guys even extra small is baggy so i was like what's the point of me carrying on ordering from sheen because obviously most of their extra smalls are like a big cut let me show you guys the stuff i'm not gonna fit it but i'll show you guys the stuff just in sheen. hey guys so i got about one two three four five six seven items um so i was ordering with a friend and in total our order came up to 1150 and then customs were 300 rand so everything was like super flawless in terms of the website uh, everything the tracking the um, the items were very were shipped to us very quickly like four days earlier as i explained to you guys so the first thing that i got this i'm happy about right it's exactly what i expected i'm not mad at this so i ordered this pajama set i've actually owned this before but I just, I lost the pants, so I decided to buy another set. So I got these in an extra small, got these in an extra, okay, uh, yeah, but I remember getting them in an extra small, right? And then I got this dress, guys. This dress on the website is giving me dinner vibes it's giving me friday dinner vibes it's giving me sexy it's giving me elegance but guys when the thing came it looks like in a dressy it fits like in a dressy I, I swear it's literally gonna look like i'm rocking up in a nightdress like guys it doesn't do justice it doesn't look that's easy you know if guys i got this in an extra small as well i am gonna be wearing this but like not for in my head when i bought it it was like for like somewhere nice you know where i don't want to be too serious but also i don't want to be too basic but this i'm gonna wear if i'm running errands because it's too basic it's too i don't like it and this is what broke my heart the most <laughs> okay so this is the dress that i was supposed to wear tonight because tonight i'll be going dinner vibes we're going like cute we're gonna be very cute today so this is the dress that i bought i knew i hated the color but i was also like you know what let me explore let me try something new because i'm a very neutral person i wear browns black white like those are my colors red if i'm pushing it but i don't wear any other color so it really looked nice with the model and when i looked at the model she looked she kind of had my body so i was like baby baby this is gonna look bomb ass ah why figure bomb ass why figure oh bomb ass it is so huge it is the color looks ugly on my body this ink oh guys i've never been so upset in my life it looks long there's a slit action happening here which is like the showstopper part of the dress this is what makes the dress look nice it's not giving the vibes like the slit is way down in my body it's not giving me thigh vibes it's not giving me thigh slit i don't know what's happening over here you know if if returning was easy i was probably going to return this because it is huge and it's one of those dresses where they are styled a certain way so i can't even alter them because if i alter them it's gonna ruin the whole pattern it just needs to fit and surprisingly enough i got this in an extra small and i was contemplating it i was like maybe i should get it in a small but the extra small is so huge whoever wants this dress please drop it down below let me just courier it to you because i know i ain't gonna be wearing that ever like ever and then i also really like this i got myself this um gown the satin gun it's giving me rich girl vibes it's giving me boss vibes I absolutely love this i will be getting this in a white again yeah this is <laughs> i'll try to take a snap um throughout the course of the day because i will be packing this with me today and then i'll show you guys how it looks like with my black pajama set so that i'm very happy about and then there was this dress initially i thought i was gonna wear this on sunday did it fit me did it fit me I, I don't know maybe i'm losing weight honestly at this point if extra small doesn't fit me what's gonna fit me what is gonna fit me hey guys so this is like a long bodycon 
makoti vibes you know so some dalang funa stefe vibes so i'm gonna wear this on a sunday on, on our sunday spa day like we, we're going on a spa lunch on sunday so that's what i was gonna wear it's not bad but it's still not giving me vibes it's giving me okay vibes and i really wanted vibes so it's not fitting my body it's not hugging my body enough it's not it just looks i mean it's already simple and this dress works if it really hugs your body so it does have a slit action happening over here it's really cute but yeah it's just one of those dresses to have in your closet there's nothing interesting about it it's not what i thought it would look like on my body and then the last clothing item i got was this basic tee this one shame it's doing what i expected it to do it's just a basic t-shirt i got this in a medium because i wanted it to have baggy vibes if you know me you know that i like myself plain t-shirts like when i'm running errands it's a matter of jeans and a t-shirt that's me so i did have a black one and then i also got myself a fanny pack because tomorrow we're going like on an adventure thing my bob like like i'm talking hiking canoeing upsailing vibes so i needed like active wear so this is gonna where i'm gonna have my phone my lip gloss yeah you know because i was where where was i gonna carry all of that and then the last i got a piece of jewelry which is like a ring because i knew that i was going to be getting a red set and i wanted some action to be happening on my hands i can't find it oh there we go so i got this ring piece i just got one jewelry item particularly because i wanted a red set and for me red hands red nails just work with some jewelry action like period that's what's all period so i got this ring it's super super cute i don't know if you guys can see it properly like oh my god oh my god oh my god ah it's big ah, obviously this is my right finger it's not my marriage finger how oh, guys look look i think everything of mine is just small look at the space here look at this oh, I'm gonna put, like, look look at how big it is oh anyway i'm still gonna wear it and that's what's on period hey guys so i have showered i just need to start packing now i just remembered that as i'm about to wear my eye lenses i remembered let me put you guys a bit further so as i'm about to wear my eye contacts i remember that um i did a um lenses contact video and in the video i was using this ao sept to install or rather to put on my eye lenses and guys here's the truth of what went down right so it was my first time using this brand as you guys know this is the brand that i'm used to right so I, for one of my eye i used this brand boy did it not burn boy did it not burn me however i didn't show that on camera or i didn't tell you guys because i really thought Uti, maybe it's me who who didn't clean it properly i didn't think the problem was the solution i really thought it, it could have been me however i did kind of also feel like why am i using a new solution and then my eyes burning so for my second eye luckily this one had run out but there was still like a little bit so for my second eye I, I went back and i used the last drop of this one to disinfect my lens and then i put it on and there was no burning so obviously i came to the conclusion that this was the problem or that maybe i had used it incorrectly so me being me i went up to them um, I went to Specsavers and I, I inquired about it. So, Guti, I used the AO Sept Plus and it burned my eye. Yeah. Um, and then because this one was out of stock. And then they explained to me that this one is to like deeply cleanse and remove all the protein from the lens. Um, and you use it to disinfect overnight. So, you put the solution and you leave your lens to soak in overnight. And then before you put it in, you need to use this one um, to cleanse out this solution. Because this one is meant to clean it's not meant to go into your eye apparently there's some chemicals that disinfect and they burn your eye so long story short i won't be using this anymore you're not allowed to use it anyway but if it has a red cap guys this is what they told me if the, if any solution has a red cap it means that it's to de it's to disinfect deeply and not to go in contact with your eye so any solution that you use has to not have a red cap so this child this thing hurt me i don't even think i'm going to be disinfecting 
throughout the night it's like i'm gonna I'm throw this away i'm gonna stick to this i'm gonna stick to what i know but for i'm for all my eye contact wearers guys this if it has a red cap any brand if it has a red cap it will burn your eye there are some chemicals in here that are not meant to go in touch with your eye okay so i just wanted to like clear that out and to mask my face since i did say that i'm masking today i'll be using the skin strategy rejuvenating face mask i got this from Deskim. This is what it looks like. It says it protects skin rejuvenation, enriched with antioxidant boosting fruit acids, fights free, eh? fights free radicals, improves skin tone and texture. So yeah, this is what I'm gonna be putting on while I am packing. I am running out of time. Lingela is on her way. Okay guys, so I've just removed the normal mask. So now I'm going in with the second coat. It's like this gold consistency that they have so now i'm just um masking with that part i just wanted to show you guys that it actually comes in like two separate masks it's it's giving like that goldish um serum vibe so some of you guys really ask me wow what do you use for your skin your skin is so clear and the honest truth is yes i take um pride in my skin like i'm into skincare i i do look after my skin but at the same time guys it has a lot to do with genes it has a lot to do with genes it has a lot to it has a lot to do with drinking water um i think as much as i don't drink as much water now but i had a good a good kick start to it like my primary high school days i used to drink a lot of water because i played netball soccer swimming i was just an active person so obviously i was always training i was always drinking water so it ended up um, falling into my routine so as much as i don't do it as often now but the kickstart to good skin was was there but obviously it's never too late to start you can just start drinking your water properly and obviously taking care of your skin um and then you obviously see better results but like 80 percent of it is genes well for in my case in my case so yeah I'll hi guys so i am at the place like the apartment no it's not a, it's not an apartment like the hotel that we're gonna be at it's like a conference um it's like a conference hotel vibe let me take you guys on a little room tour um i'm kind of holding my gown here because we got some cleavage action happening down there <laughs> um yeah i'm on, i'm alone for now because i obviously need to get ready um let me take you guys on a quick room tour let's start from outside right hey okay, guys so this is what the outside looks like so obviously when you are coming down to my room you come down from those stairs this is what the other side looks like and then you obviously this is my room enter all right so when you enter there's a little side table which i absolutely love the stands of this side lamp i really think this gold is amazing so the place where i'm at is called the gregory bed and breakfast conferencing it's like it's in pine town guys so if you're in durban you know where this is and then we have our bed that we're gonna be sleeping in period and in this land there's like a tea and coffee um place they were kind enough to actually bring us some water which i'll be putting in the fridge and then there's a little couch happening over there I won't be using that couch. I don't think anyone is going to be using it. And then we have a TV at the top. Then we have some wall painting, some more art. Absolutely love, love, love. Look at the red of my nails. Look at the pigments, period. And then we have these lovely gray curtains. I'm still going to take you guys outside. And then here we have my luggage. I will be staying over here for two nights. And then we have my wigs that I'll be wearing um, this weekend. I think for tonight, I am going to install this one because I feel like you guys haven't seen me in some color action, you know. And then we have another couch here. And then we have like this little cozy corner, which is absolutely cute. It's like a dinner for two type of vibe. I don't think we're gonna be using this though because we have a lot planned out for this weekend. I don't really see us sitting here, but yeah, it's like a little cozy area. And then this side, okay, then we have um, my side of the bed, my bag. Then there's a little bar fridge over here. And then 
the bathroom. So I did get here and take a shower. That's why you see my towel. Absolutely love the tiles at this place. So we have a basin um, with some hand lotion as well as hand wash. And then um, some plant, some plant deco going on and then obviously my toiletry bag and my got to be as i will be installing some hair oops, 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 oops. then you have me in the mirror mm -hmm. and then there's a tub absolutely love how cute it looks then we have a toilet and then when you come around the side there's the shower i really like um the style that they make showers in like there's no door here there's no door here it's just the shower so yeah, and that is our room for the two nights. So let me quickly install my hair. Um, I've already prepped my face for makeup. And then I'll go upstairs to Lungi's room. Um, she's already doing her face. It's just that I, I had to freshen up first. And then, yeah, we're also running late because we need to fetch Lungelwa's hair. When we fetched my hair, it wasn't ready. So we need to go back, period. So we need to, like, they close at half past five. So we obviously need to make it there in time. I'm just going to take you guys outside so that you guys can see the outside view. It's like, this is the outside of my room. The only thing I don't like about this place is that it's near, like, a main road. So I really don't vibe with that. But that's the only thing that I don't like about the place so far. Had I known, I probably wouldn't have booked it because like, it's noisy. As you guys can hear, you guys can barely even hear me. I don't know if I'm going to be able to take you guys like outside. No, I will. I will. I'll take you guys like outside so that you guys can see the place. Lingyelo's room basically looks like this. It's just that it's upstairs. So she has a little balcony situation, but it's the same thing. Isn't that thing up here? Know how I look. You look beautiful. You look beautiful. You know? It's also nice. Not here. Oh. Makes our job easier. I know, but I was right about the time thing, friend. Like, says again, Amanj. Mm -hmm. How are you feeling? I'm gay. <laughs> how am I supposed to be feeling? Uh, excited. How are you feeling? Good. <laughs> Good. Fernanda, how are you feeling? <laughs> Tired. Oh, my sister's a miss. Susan, I'm there. You didn't yeah, think this thing. <laughs> we didn't think this Yeah, that's it. I'm going to for Instagram. Okay. It's been an amazing weekend oh my god so guys i couldn't vlog um much because you know from the point where i stopped vlogging our partners were around so i couldn't um vlog that part with our partners around because simply that's not what we're looking for um personally i'm not even a person who i'll never have a public relationship like you guys will probably never see <laughs> this partner of mine Yo guys, I just came back from the spa. You like me? I'm super, super happy. You want to see me? I feel so rejuvenated or whatever. Obviously, I couldn't show you guys that because... Yeah, I just, I couldn't. I couldn't show you guys. But yeah, I just got my face done. And a full body massage. Oh, we absolutely enjoyed pampering so basically long story short um yeah i got as much footage as i can of the parts where i could get but then also i was really trying to be to be present and to be in it and to be you know to really spend quality time and really celebrate so those were the vibes um i think i will be going on another vacation i told you guys this earlier right 
Um, so another thing that happened, my cousin passed away, unfortunately, which is like he was sick. I think we saw it coming. Like, if I'm being honest with you, I think I dealt with this before it happened because I could see it was okay. So he passed away. So I was going on vacation next week again. But obviously that is moved because we have to go to the funeral in Ngotu. So, yeah, I don't know when it's postponed to. It's going to depend on the availability of the place. But it will happen this year. It's just that it's not happening soon, right? So, yeah, I think I'm going to close off this vlog now. I'm just going to unpack, eat, prepare for the week you know the drill um yeah thank you guys so so much for watching i really do hope that you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like to comment and to subscribe and to check out me and to check me out on instagram so that you know what i'm up to if i'm not on youtube but for now you definitely are a star i'll see you on my next video i love you bye